Hello folks, this is Scott with Dallas Paint Correction and Luxury Microfiber here in Dallas, Texas. I want to talk about this little bad boy here. This is the AR Blue, it's called the Max. M-A-X-X, -X. it's 2200 PSI, 13 amp, it's gallons per minute is 1.2 gallons per minute. That is its weak link with this unit. Now, I also want to say that I did not purchase this. AR Blue actually sent it to me and wanted my opinion about it. They said, Scott, we know you won't like the 1.2 gallons per minute, but what would you change about it if you could? Obviously, I would increase the gallons per minute. They also wanted to know, Scott, how do you like it as far as its noise level? A lot of these entry-level green works, right? They can scream when they're running. You ever notice when you release the pressure or you release the handle, they kind of wind down and they have a high-pitched scream to it? This unit is very impressive, and I'll tell you why. It's far quieter than most electric power washers, and it does not have a high-pitched squeal when you release the trigger. What I did is I had a decibel machine, and I held it right over the unit. I squeezed the trigger, so we've got noise, from the high pressure coming out the end of the lance, we've got the noise from the machine itself and being right here over it with a decibel meter, it was 61 decibels. That's pretty impressive because normal conversations between two people is about 35 decibels. The other thing that's interesting, when you release the pressure, this is a total start-stop function. Squeeze it, the motor runs, release the trigger, and the unit turns off. This does not have that high-pitched squeal and slow wind down when you release the trigger. I'm actually going to run this machine right here as we stand over it. My camera makes everything so loud, but I'm telling you it's about 61 decibels as we stand here. But listen to the way this thing operates. The pitch and tone is very different versus entry-level uh, electric power washers like Greenworks and stuff. But I'm going to squeeze the trigger. You'll notice it has like a soft start or a, I don't want to say slow start, it's not very slow, there's about a one second or two second delay, but let's listen to the way it sounds. But more importantly, when I release the trigger, listen to the machine. This thing turns off instantly. It's got like a little, almost sounds like it's releasing air, like a little, a little noise like that, right? Scott, that sounded funny. Let's hear it again. That's pretty cool. Very, very quiet. I'm very impressed with that. Now what I'll do is I'll walk away from the unit and get over towards the car. Sorry for being shaky. And then I'll run this thing. Again, it's 2200 PSI. 1.2 gallons per minute that has got to come up if it was uh, it was an option with me But let me go ahead and run it. I'm almost now about 20 25 feet away from this thing Most of the noise you're going to hear is from the high-pressure water coming out the lance. You can barely hear the machine Now what's pretty nice is the hose, I'm all the way out 20-25 feet, it's not rolling up or kinking up like those entry level green works do. Now I want to talk about its versatility and price. And then I'll get back to my opinion of what AR Blue Clean should do with this thing to make me absolutely happy. Let me set this down and talk about it quickly. This unit, I did not purchase the unit, it was sent to me, I'll be honest about that. And they wanted my opinion. I've got, uh, I've got i got some pros with it and I've got some cons. This unit here, direct from AR Blue, is 550 bucks. I wouldn't panic though, I did a quick search and I found online that Walmart can get this thing for you, the Blue Max 2200 PSI 1.2 gallon per minute, at 304 bucks. That is 200 hours more than a basic entry level Greenworks. What's very interesting about this is I pulled the screws, there's eight screws on the bottom of this thing and pulled the cover off. The motor inside this thing is very big. In fact, it covers just about every square inch of this casing. Very large motor. It's not like an entry-level Greenworks or Ryobi where the motor's just a little bit bigger than a Coke can. 
the motor in this thing is pretty pretty big this thing weighs 45 to 50 pounds outside the cart just the way you could transport it like this very attractive for a mobile detailer it's versatility that you can transport it like this or put it on a cart with wheels that comes with it I didn't even bother putting the cart together I don't want to use it that way but you got it it also you can also buy a wall mount for this thing and hang it on your garage wall or simply have a shelf on your garage wall if you had a line on this thing or a hose you upgraded your hose and you were 50 feet away from this machine and it was on the wall of your garage you would not hear it at all run this thing at eight o'clock in the morning on a Sunday your neighbors are not going to get pissed that's pretty cool now the standard gun and wand to this it's better than the Greenworks one right the hose is even better that's that those hoses love to just kink up and they're hard to straighten out but this has got like a rubberized hose it's much more flexible it stays straight once you get it out the accessories are just standard I'm not going to beat up AR blue for that but it is better um, accessories than the entry-level Greenworks and Ryobi really cool again it weighs about 45 pounds I love its versatility carry it like this put it in a cart hang it on the wall with a wall mount or have a shelf if AR Blue made this thing, it doesn't even have to be 2200 PSI. If they made it 1500 PSI, but increased the gallons per minute to 2.1, 2.2 gallons per minute, folks, this would be a very, very sexy winner. Very, very nice machine because it's so versatile. Now, AR Blue has a version like this. It's called the AR2N1. This is not that unit. This is the motor inside. This is far bigger and more substantial and again this thing weighs about 45 50 pounds the way it sits pretty cool it's got some nozzles that come with it right so if we move this gun you can see the four nozzles that plug in it's also a turbo nozzle it's got these little carrying cases for the gun and the lance if you wanted to and walk away with it that's cool it has a soap dispenser I'd never use this but you could again the cord that comes out of this thing it's got a GFCI plug on the end of it it's about 35 foot long really really cool machine I love the fact that it's very very quiet very low decibels even when you're standing right over the top of it the fittings for this thing are they are an M2215 if you had a better hose already in a gun you like the Mosmatics and MV925 or MTM and you had a better hose you wanted to attach to it you can get an M2215 3 8 male plug and just have a quick disconnect they're easy to find you won't find them in like Lowe's or Home Depot you'll probably have to look on Amazon very, Amazon very easy to find but it's a very sexy machine folks I love its noise and I love how it doesn't squeal when you release the gun let's listen to that again that is pretty pretty attractive now if blue uh, AR blue made this 1500 psi 2.2 gallons per minute and had it retailed for about 400 bucks with its versatility it is a very very sexy machine it's not industrial it's better than your entry level maybe this is like kind of mid-tier uh, versus entry level but it's not industrial it's not going to give you the performance of a Comet or a Krenzel if you can't afford a Krenzel and you can't afford a Comet this is a nice unit to look at if we can get AR Blue to increase the gallons per minute wow this thing would be very very sexy just wanted to share that with you I hope that helps you out I love it it's uh, you know again it's pretty heavy 45 50 pounds if you put this thing on the shelf it's not moving or if you hung it on the wall with their wall mount because I think AR does have a wall mount for it pretty cool but AR Blue if you can increase the gallons per minute I'd be all over it not that I won't use it I will I'll use this around the house I was opening up my pool today I use it to clean patio furniture my pool furniture did a phenomenal job love the fact that it's very quiet for a power washer or an electric power washer it'll get the job done but could you imagine if this was 2.2 gallons per minute and it retailed for about 400 bucks with a two-year limited uh, warranty that's what it comes with the first year it's bumper to bumper the second year is whatever the fine print is on the warranty card folks I love you I hope that helps you out pretty cool the hose attachment comes in from the front and so does the outlet that thing was hung on the wall and the two lines were pointed down 
that'd be kind of cool you could put a reel below it if you wanted to who knows lots of options lots of versatility they just got to get the gallons permitted up and this sucker would be really really cool i love you guys talk to you soon